I'm Mary Clark with Mother Model Management from St. Louis. We discovered Carly Kloss, Grace Hartzell, and Ashton Kutcher, models that actually became stars. We do things the way that we would want it to be done with our own kids. That's the joy that we have in it. It's New York Fashion Week. I just got here next. It's a management company that we have many models with. Jeff's already here, my husband, my partner. Looking at the schedule, looking at each okay, cool. girl's right, schedule right. and figuring out where do we go, where where are we most needed, and what's unfolding in real time. Go team mother. <laughs> it's always exciting, a little bit exhausting, but exhilarating at the same time. I'm from a small town, I'm from Cedar Rapids, Iowa, and I became a single mom when I was 19 years old. I was very much on my own. I would go to the Barnes & Noble and just look at fashion magazines like they were textbooks. I would look at the faces and go, oh, her eyes are wide set apart, or isn't that interesting, the angle of her face? It just became something that I love. Katie Green, it's her first season. We found her pushing her cart through Target. A little over the next year, she's here. I found a guy at a bar named Ashton Kutcher. He was up at the bar buying a beer, flannel shirt, puka shell wearing frat boy. And I went up to him and said, have you ever thought about being a model? And he was like, I didn't even know guys did that. I kept saying, how old are you? And he wouldn't answer me, which I thought was unusual, but then I realized it's because he was 19 and he wasn't supposed to be ordering the beer that he was drinking. He was a rocket ship. I took Kutcher to New York and he did his first fashion show, like shot Abercrombie and Fitch with Bruce Weber. A few months later, he got that 70s show. In fashion week's the most unpredictable time. Things can change in two hours or overnight. The event is starting. It is. One of our new girls, Alana, she opened the show at a very highly publicized event. She's the first rookie. This is like one of her first things that she's ever done. And not only did she rise to the occasion, she told us, I belong here. It's a business, but it really is wonderful to watch somebody at 14 now on a stage and to have been there in that process. It's indescribable. I'm about to meet with Joel. He's the co-owner of Next Worldwide. He's an icon in this industry. And we just want to go over how he sees things. It's amazing to have these Midwestern girls with good values, clean living, and everything else. And they come to New York from Iowa or from Missouri and to the big city, and they don't shrink. Their eyes are open and they're just looking and it's great to see how they grow. Success yeah. breeds yeah. confidence. Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah, But it has to be taught that. Building out the proper career and having them ready. Yeah. Right. That's the key. Now I'm gonna meet with Emily. She submitted pictures to us. We saw something that was intriguing. Thanks for being patient. Hi, hon. I'm Emily. Nice to meet you, babe. You How are you? I'm good. Are you excited? Yeah. Are you nervous? Good. Don't be nervous. <laughs> here, let's go in here. There's nothing to be nervous about, I promise. Have you shot with anybody? Have you done anything in your area or? No, there's not really much around me. <laughs> That's okay. You're not necessarily looking for pretty, because pretty is everywhere, but you're looking for beautiful and interesting and maybe they weren't the popular girl of the class or maybe they were the awkward girl or at 16 you can't really model in New York you're brand new and haven't done anything the process is to kind of keep an eye on somebody while they grow and develop something that would be cool to do we have a photographer and she can shoot you she's super sweet and then we'll kind of take it from there we hug. Probably needs development and grooming, which is not a bad thing. It's a normal, common thing. My name is Emily Kelly. I'd like to track her and see how she grows. I'm six feet tall and I'm 16 years old. One more time. It's as valuable to us that you find a Grace Hartzell who becomes a superstar as it is 
to find the person who then finds themselves in the process and it opens up a whole other world for them. They're equally satisfying to us.